A rally to support Lakeview Fort Oglethorpe cheerleaders and their religious banners draws a passionate crowd. The Catoosa School District determined a long-standing tradition violated federal law. Supporters say it's the rights of the cheerleaders that are being violated. More now in our top local story. That is stopping our freedom of religion. Hundreds of people filled the polo fields in Fort Oglethorpe to support LFO cheerleaders and their inspirational signs. They can't stop the tradition that we have at LFO. The girls spend the summer preparing signs like this one with Bible verses on them. Football players burst through them at the start of the game. The problem is the location. After a verbal complaint, Catoosa School Superintendent Dana Reese determined having the biblical banners on the field violated the First Amendment of the Constitution. It broke my heart to have to tell those girls that they could not display that message on the football field. The location inside the football field creates the impression that the school system is endorsing that particular religious message. She says the banners can be displayed in a designated spot outside the stadium. I don't see how that's a problem. They're saying they can put it outside of the field, but it's still on school property. So what difference does that make? People at this rally don't see the distinction and worry about where it will end. I think the response we're getting is people tired of this, tired of the government taking away our rights, telling us what we can and cannot do when it comes to our freedom of speech. They've signed a petition to bring to the school board Tuesday and plan to pack the stands with messages from the Bible during Friday's game. Instead of seeing it just for a couple of seconds, now they're going to see it for a very long time, so they should have just left it alone. Now it's going to be there for two hours in the game because I, if I have to hold it up myself, it's going to be held up there. And tonight we put the question to you. Do you think the cheerleader banners are a violation against school-sponsored religion? Taking a look at the results, a majority of our viewers think the banners don't affect how anyone worships. That's followed by people who wonder if there aren't bigger issues out there to worry about than cheerleader banners. You can vote in our poll too and leave us a comment at WDF.com.